All right, let's take a look at this together. Um, what I want to show you here is mostly just the idea that linking the algebra to the geometry. So we have got a vertical, vertical pair there, uh, vertical angles. We have a linear pair here. We have a set of complement angles here. I want to just quickly show you that we don't always set them equal to each other. In this first case, actually, we end up doing that. We say x plus 20 equals 2x plus 12. And the reason we can say that is because we know that vertical angles uh, are congruent or equal to each other. So we can go ahead and just uh, say that. And then we would solve, so we would get uh, 1x over here equals 8. And then oftentimes they'll ask for x, but they'll also sometimes ask for the angle. So if you substitute that back in, you find out that each of those angles has to be 28 in size. So uh, that's that particular arrangement. Let's look at the next one. This is a linear pair. We don't set these equal to each other. These two angles together make 180 degrees. So the 2x angle and the 3x angle equal 180. Why is that true? Is that a linear pair, linear pairs, um, are supplements. They add up to 180 degrees. So you and I would just solve 5x equals 180. Uh, x equals goes in 3 and 6 more. Um, that would be a total of 36. Then again, we would take that and plug it in. So that would be a 72 there. And then that would be 3 times 36 for its value as well. So notice in this case, um, we set them equal to 180. We did not um, set them equal to each other. Very important uh, distinguishing factor. The last one you'll notice uh, is a set of complement angles. So we will say that 2x and x plus 30 together equal 90. So this angle and this angle together equal 90. That's because they are complements, two angles that sum to 90. And so we get 3x plus 30 equals 90, we get 3x equals 60, and x equals 20. This angle then would be a 40 value, and this angle here would be a 50 value. Notice they add up together. What I wanted to mostly just make sure you understood is do not always set these things equal to each other. You must evaluate the relationship first.